Hello, my lovely Cancers. This is your holistic reading for the month of September 2022 for Cancer, the star sign Cancer. Um, remember, this is a holistic reading, not a one-to-one -one reading. So this will resonate for some people and not for others, or maybe parts of it will resonate for you. So I'm just pulling a holistic spread on this. And let's see what the spirit guides and angels and universe, whatever you want to say or believe in for yourself. That's for the higher good of yourself and others. Uh, let's see what they have to say for you, okay? So let's. what's the message for my lovely Cancerians for the month of September 2022? Okay, so Cancerians are generally um, emotional by nature as well, um, but I'm, I'm seeing something about money, like your focus right now is on money. There might be sort of a legal legality or some sort of judgment that you're going to get financially wise. Um, you do have a very emotional female in your life that um, emotionally charges you. Um, and kind of makes you feel disconnected sometimes, but at the same time fulfilled. I don't know if that makes sense to you, but that's kind of what I'm feeling. It's kind of like a tug of war, like a yin and a yang kind of feeling of this person. Um, but it could be a career, like somebody in your workplace. Maybe it's a boss or something, or maybe it's a, a, a relative or a loved one in your life. Um, but your focus right now is money. You really want, are looking for ways to make more money. Um, you, It looks like you do come into a little bit of money, but I don't necessarily know if it's the way you wanted the money to come in. However, it still makes you fulfilled and happy about it. Um, uh, but I generally see it's positive, you know. So I, I think that, yeah, you're going to make some money and you're going to help other people. But there is somebody in your life that's making you emotional about certain things. Kind of making you feel a bit withdrawn or a little bit um, not a little bit uneasy about the way you're making the money. Or the way that you're moving in your career or with a relationship. So I hope that that makes sense for you. Uh, let's see what the astrology cards have to say for my lovely Cancerians. For my lovely Cancerians. Opposition, yeah. Imbalance, a point of tension and a power struggle. Yeah, there, see, I told you there's somebody in your life that's having a power struggle with you that's pulling you. And a yin and a yang that's unbalancing you. House 7, profound relations, intimacy and romantic partnerships. And Mars move forward and defend self like you have to defend yourself it's like you've made money or you've done something really positive and something's worked out really well for you and this person is making you feel guilty about it it's like you don't feel good about it. like you've done something really good but the person's not making you feel good about it because maybe in their mind the way you've either got the money or got the relationship or whatever it is is not been integral but you're like no but it was this is how it was and you're kind of having to defend yourself and you're not feeling good about something that's actually positive that's happened to you you're not feeling good about it because of this person in your life it's making you feel awkward about the situation so you know i would say the universe is just saying if it's right if it's spiritually right and you're connected to the higher level of light love um that's for the higher purpose for everybody else then accept it that it is good and don't worry about what other people think if there's something that you feel that you could have done better own it acknowledge it um fix it if you can and move past it you know but you know, don't break the friendship or the relationship if you can, if it's something that you can fix, right? So that is what I'll say. I'm going to ask a yes, no, or you're going to ask a yes, no question. And I'm going to pull three cards to give you an answer on your yes, no question. Okay. So think of a question that you, that is a yes or no, and that you would like to ask the spirit guides and angels. And I'm going to ask them to give me three cards to answer your question for the yes, no question you have. Okay. So yes, no question for my lovely Cancerians. Yes, yes, yes. So you got three yeses for the question. So whatever the question is, it's a lot. It's a fast movement. It's a major great opportunity and you're going to shine in it. So whatever you asked for the yes, no question, it's a major yes and it's a positive yes. Move forward. You're going to shine. It's going to bring out a positive reaction to people around you. And you're going to look like the hero because I know Cancers do like to look like the heroes of the families because they often feel like they are the orphans of the families or the outcasts or loners of the families. But you are going to actually 
bring people together and you're going to shine out and people are going to go, oh my gosh, look at this person, uh, whoever you are. And they're going to be like, this person did great. And you're going to have a really great opportunity from it. So yes, is the answer to that question. Have a great month, uh, my lovely Cancerians. Until next time, have a great one. Bye for now.